Hey guys, this is Mike from ProMusicProducers.com. In this first episode, we're going to take a look on this deep house beat. From creating the drums to exploring Ableton's built instrument, this is a must for every beginner in this house genre. We'll use a tempo of 123 beats per minute. Insert a drum rack for the kick and one for the percussion sounds. Insert the kick sample into the drum rack and draw a basic 4x4 beat. Important to a drum rack the percussion samples that you downloaded along with this tutorial. And I'll try to create a nice groovy rhythm for this track. Okay, that sounds pretty nice. Use another drum rack for the snares and claps. Let the snare hit with a second and fourth beat, but move it slightly to the left for a bigger effect. Duplicate this bar and insert the other samples before the last snare. All right, now for our hats. First one will go off beat. The other hat will play a different pattern with different velocity settings on each hit. Okay, on track number five, I got the DSK Indian Dreams free VST plugin that you downloaded with this pack. We're going to use the preset called Tabla. Follow me while I try to create a nice rhythm with these percussion sounds. 
insert a D minor scale. Okay, now from Ableton's instrument rack, insert the percussion preset called Bongo Selection. We'll use a very simple three note sequence. Now for our bass. From the synth bass folder, insert the bass preset LFO. This preset is excellent for this genre. Follow me while I try to create a nice deep house bass line. Insert a D minor scale. Alright, let's add some chords. From the synth chord folder, select the watery pipe preset. I'll remove some low frequencies from this track. Add a chord effect on it and select plus three and plus seven semitones for a minor chord.
we need to decrease the delay and decay settings on this track. That's it for this episode. Hope we gave you some motivation to just go there and explore all those built-in presets. See if you can come up with something nice. Cheers!